this is the Leica X1. You see it's a completely manual camera if you choose to, but you also have the full automatic by selecting A. You can select all different shutter speeds as well as different apertures. On top of the camera you also have a pop-up flash. By pressing in the flash it will pop up and you can just press it down if you choose not to use the flash. There's a hot shoe to put an optional flash unit onto the camera or an optical viewfinder that is optional. The back of the camera, very simple menu, playback button, you have the different focusing functions, so you can select if you want to have face detection or the different focusing points. You have the white balance where you can select the different white balance options, everything from the different automatic white balance functions to the manual Kelvin setting. You have the ISO button which allows you to select the auto ISO or any ISO between 100 and 3200. And below here you have the info button which provides you with additional info on the, in the playback function but it also allows you to select how you want to view the LCD screen. Main menu is by pressing the menu button. Now we'll quickly scroll to the top. You can select the resolution, the different compression, the camera shoots in DNG RAW file. And by pressing the right button, you can actually go in and make changes. The RAW file is an open RAW format and can be read in any software. Those are the standard settings. This prototype camera has um, a pretty much final firmware. There are only minor changes that are getting adjusted right now. But here at the trade show at Photo Plus East, we are showing samples um, taken with this camera. And you will see the stunning quality. Here you have the different flash functions that come up. So once we have the pop-out flash, you can select the auto or any other of the flash functions. You also have the autofocus and manual focus settings. Once you decide to go into manual focus and confirming it with the set button, you can now manual focus. If you want to manual focus you get a magnifying glass in the center and then you have the bar which allows you to read how the focusing was actually done. It is a very handy tool to see if uh, the manual focus uh, was successful. the self timer obviously and you have also over and under exposure the exposure bracketing or exposure compensation this is a new Leica X1